1 Corinthians 10, 15. Weigh my words for yourself. This is something we should do with all teachers. Of course, we see um, he's in scripture, so it's divine. Um, we understand it as truth. But when people teach, we should do this. And even the way scripture is presented, we should weigh it against other scriptures so that we don't take it out of context. Okay. Um, Job 2, 3. through five. Job two, three, through five. Okay. The Lord said to Satan, Have you considered my servant Job? For there is none like him in the land, a blameless and upright man, who fears God and turns away from evil. He still maintains his integrity, although you incited me against him. To ruin him without cause. So God has a plan with all this. And God's telling Satan. You tested him. But he didn't break. He's still living right for me. Now of course God knows he ain't sinless. And I don't think Satan buys that he's sinless. But he's when he makes evil. He turns to God. Doing it rightly. Striving for the best that he can. As a sinful man. Satan answered the Lord and said, Skin for skin, yes, all that a man has, he will give for his own li his life. I don't necessarily know. I mean, he lost practically everything. But Satan's point is, it just wasn't tough enough. And I, I think the situation more drawn out is more likely to make us break than it just being tougher. And because at this point, Job pretty much went through everything Satan could throw at him. Just about. But if it would have been a slower process, I don't know, it could have been harder. But the point is, I say, Job did not break. But Satan's still not giving up. Which means that Satan's going to try to break us as Christians. Even more so, the more closely we cling to the Lord. But put forth your hand now. Satan's telling God to do this. Because Satan don't have power to do this. And touch his bone and his flesh. And he will renounce you and your face. So now he's talking about bringing sickness, disease upon Job. Just taking away his health. Satan wants to hurt us. Satan wants to can hurt, attack us. But he has to get permission from God. Which means that ultimately God has a plan for it. And it's for us to cling to him, trust him. He can bring us through some things sometimes. And him use us during them times always. <clears throat> 